Hippos, hippos, hippos. So these are in the celebration catalog, which starts next month. But of course, I'm going to preview a bunch of stuff. Of course, can't help myself. Hi, Leslie, Iris, Kim, Barbara, Betty, Betty, Barbara S., Charlotte, Judith, Kathy. Where's Penny? We're missing the entertainment. And there she is. <laughs> Hi, Penny and Cecilia and Mary. Yeah, so hippest hippos and the hippo dies. So all three of these get cut out. That's an absolute bonus right there. But you can earn these um, $50 order next month. You can get one. And with a $100 order, you get both. But there's other things. I wish I could show you the catalog, but I can't until next month. Can't open it. Not allowed. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right. So the other. Oh, something just went flying. That's the name of the game. So the other set that I'm using is also a celebration set. And this one, I think this one was 100 to earn. Yeah, I think so. But I use the woohoo and something else. Maybe you've got this. I don't even know. We'll see when I get there. What else did I use? Um, tea Boutique. I use this. And the rest is on this paper. So if my eye, oh, blurry. Better. Okay, so if my eyes cooperate, we'll, we'll be good. So card number one is this one. It's so cute. It's so cute. Oh, a few of these dropped today. But I got them in here. So when I'm ready... I'm going to set that up there. Uh, I already colored all my hippos. But so I cut two. I'm going to cut off. I almost cut off more than I meant to. I'm going to cut off that one. Glue. It's hiding. Right there. So I originally meant for it to like totally cover it, but then when I was putting it on, I liked a little bit of this sticking out. So it's just got a little hangover there. Umbrellas like to drink, you know. All right. So this gets colored, but yes, yes, I'm cheating. I'm using my other one so I don't have to use so much of the blending. Um, T1 and T0 should do it. So like I did the other um, planter, last month come in from the sides i go across the bottom and i'm going to try getting away with just two is that the right one yeah
I'm going to use the blender. And then, wrong side. And then just blend the middle in. So if you were going to use ours, you would, oops, I forgot that thing. So you would have to, to get a lighter shade, take it off of our blender and then put it down. If that makes sense, I hope, I hope. So this is going to get stamped with awe. You really are the best. I got to fix those two little pieces that I forgot. Ugh. Perfect. I like it. I like it. All right. Let me just fix that little thing there. Oh, helps to use one with a color. Okay. Okay, you can go there and awe can dry. There's the little guy. So then I'm going to take a little green, and I used old olive, but we'll see if there's enough left on here. Nope. Penny, you got your relatives with you? So very lightly, we're just making a little bit of grass like that. Now, let's see if there's enough on this. There might be. So this was Orchid, Orchid Oasis. I'm just going to blend into the grass a little bit. No, I don't want to dip you. Come on. Come on. Okay, that's good. Okay, so when I put this down, I just did the sides. Like that. This guy. Is only going to be partially. Popped up. Now you actually could pop up the the tub. Oh, you know what I forgot? To do his cheeks, her cheeks, his cheeks. I don't know. So I'm going to grab the light petal pink. Now, when I colored this one, I did this one with um, an ink, the ink pads. So I actually kind of watercolored it, kind of. Yeah, it looks good enough. And then we can give a little color. I might need the other one. I think it's dying. Oh, and 
little manicure. I don't think I did any of them. And I'm going to take some light balmy blue. And give her some. Now it's a her. So I didn't really make it look like it was being held in her hand. I just kind of glued it down. Behind her. And you can shade these more if you want or leave them just as they are. Okay, then there's all these little grassy things. Where's my... So I did these um, cran um, cranberry, um, old olive, old olive, granny apple, and the new one is, what is it, what is it, parakeet party. So I'll see if two, two, and two work. Maybe, maybe not. And I love the combination, whoops, of the Orchid Oasis and the Granny Apple. Lower that a little. Simply the best, better than all the rest. Do, do, do. Yeah, we'll do one more. I mean, you could fill it up if you really wanted to. Okay. Then it's going to get mounted on... Oh, I still got to put the little splashes. Splash, splash here, splash, splash there. Oh, you're going to do your granddaughter's card with the hippo? Hippo, hippo, hippo. So where was this paper? This paper, oh yeah, that's right. This was from the T. Duh. I already said that. Oh, la, la, la. Ooh. I don't want to sing too loud. I might break a glass good opera voice of mine. Okay. So now this is going to get popped up. Of course. 
with lots of dimensionals. Thanks, Penny. Oh, you could use that as little hand prints. Now that's thinking out of the box. Or like like duck feet or something walking across a card it's what you got to do in stamping sometimes think out of the box That's going to go in the middle. I think I put them over to the right too much. Then it's like you need something over there. So one will go there. Turn over. I never have luck turning them over. There you go. And... Stop it. Stop it. Like a pancake. Turn over. Flip. Psh. Ta da! Ooh, maybe I could put more and that'll like fill it up. Big splash. Now, why did I do that? Does anybody know? Anybody? Anybody? Now it's going to stay there. No, it won't. And it's got a booger on it. Uh, uh, uh. Well, I wanted something on the card, so there it is. Where's my regular eraser? I don't know. Hmm. I'll find the other one later and fix it. Maybe. Um, something else was supposed to be done to this. Yes. Yes. A few sparklies. So these are opal rounds. Maybe right there. And I don't got to do nothing. Ta da! So there is card number one. So cute. Hippos are gorgeous. I only have three cards tonight. Here's card number two. So for this one, and everything is in the description, the sizes. Okay, so this is from Rings of Love, which is also, you can earn free in the celebration. Oh. 
Okay, so for this one, what I did here is cut two, one in the balmy blue and then one in granny apple. And then I just took it and used the piece like to make the waves. Most of that gets covered up anyway. And it'll fit exactly. I did that on a nut, the last card too, which is the third card, which is the next card. Okay, so then this is just going to go down flat. Okay, then she... Everything but her toe is going to be popped. You got to hold it. And then basically the same thing with him. A little bit more of him is going to get glued down. And just hold that for a sec. He's winking. So this could be a Valentine card. Oh, there's hearts in there also. I could have I could have put a few hearts around. Just thought of that. See, things always hit me later. Love you a ton. And then again, put there. Oh, yeah. Forgot these. Maybe on purpose. <laughs> so that kind of covers up the wave. But it could be just a grassy mound. One more, one more. And there, let's see, I didn't do his, let's make his nails darker. Maybe that will work. Of course not.
So we're doing them with dark smoky slate. And I'm just actually putting a dot. I don't care if there's a little bit of, of white left there. Maybe I do. And we can give him a blue eye also, but not as much as her. So there's card number two. Hi, Rosemary, Marlene. Who else did I miss? Probably a lot of people. All right. Now, this is my favorite one. Look at that, so cute. So I colored that a little different. I cut it out in white. All right, so something, here it is. The little outboard motor. So I cut that out in white. Is that the right side? Yeah. And I'm going to do the same thing. Just give it a little bit of... A little bit of gray. That's too light. All right, light smoky slate. And that'll be too dark. Yep. So, then you take a lighter one. And smooth it all out. Okay, you stay right there. Don't go away. Now, you can. I didn't do it on the other one. But you can. Oh, uh, let's hope I don't ruin it. <laughs> you can. Dark crumb cake. No, I want light, light, light crumb cake. So you can go in like where the line is. And give it a little dimension. You do the same thing. like we did before. So we're just giving it a little bit. Not a lot. Just a little. And then I'm just going to take the clear which is very full and just blend the edges and that'll dry evaporate all right so we're going to put that aside for now because we're going to do this so this is from this big package a lot of sheets in there. Of course, it doesn't say on here how many. So, watch how we turn this into something totally different. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We're using this too. Ray. Hi, Ray. So, so with Daffodil Delight, Do you like the dyes with this set? Yeah. 
yeah, you can use them with other things too. I mean, the only one is is the grass. But I wish it was more grassy. But I'll show you what you can if I have them in here. I was playing with them. I cut out some glasses and Okay, so we're going to take this, lay it right about there. Oh, lost one earlier. Looky at that. Okay, so this is going to get mounted onto a black base. Come on, glue. Now, I cut two of these, one in the balmy blue and then one in the, yep, what's it called? Oh, yeah. Uh, Tahitian Tide. Tahitian Tide. And then what I did is I took that die and just laid it like in the middle and cut. Then I put it a little bit to the side and cut so like they're not exactly even. You know, this part being even. But one's going to go on the bottom. And I'm just doing the sides. It's going to line up perfectly. I said uh, perfectly. Okay. Then, of course, this one, that's going to be the top of it. It's going to slide in there. Yep. Just got to make sure that's going to, yep. And then that one, get in there. Oh, I know why, because I went too high up on the side. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, uh all good all right so we need the boat boat's gonna go right there so that's gonna get tucked in at an angle So that one I colored. Then here's the little guy, the motor. Oh, 
with too much glue. I guess I could tuck that in. It's under the wave. Oh, yeah, he gets partially popped up. And stop. He's going to slide in. Could you slide in a little better? No. Oh, yes, you can. I knew it. So he's really behind the wave, actually. All right, then, then, I should do his nails, too, <laughs> and his blue eyes. So we need this little thing that says, you're so hip. You're so hip. And this is on Mango Melody. Oh. Okay, now comes the fun part. Well, I'll do this part first. So you've got this. But do I? All right, you go here. All right, I'll put that on in a minute. Whoa. I almost put that on the stamp. So I probably should have done this in, in advance, but I remembered and then I forgot. Well, at some point I said, I'll just cut it. Then I didn't want to cut it while I was on. Because I'm not as fast as Tony. Let's just let that dry a second. See if I move too fast. Woohoo! So here we go. Maybe I'm not going to go into. Yeah, I'm not going to. I might do it after uh, if I don't like it. Tony does it so smooth. Ooh. I want to smudge it either. Shut up, Penny. Hmm? <laughs> And my nose is running. Oh my God, last night I was finishing up the the last card. This one, actually. Or maybe, I don't know which one it was. Let's see how that looks if I just go straight across. 
Yeah, I don't like it. So I was thirsty. So I took a drink of my water and it went down the wrong way. And I went <laughs> like all, I was like, oh my God, just missed the cards. I was like, so thankful. Alrighty, so now I got to do that piece in the woo. Okay, one down. Now we just need the who. Woo. I need a drink. I just don't want to spit it all over again. Okay, so the H is kind of worse than the W. But I'll tell you what, it's better with this bigger scissor than it was with the little one. Whoops. Maybe because I did it once already. <laughs> I don't know. And I've done things like this on the scan and cut, but you have to connect everything. Because if you don't connect it, it cuts it separate, which wouldn't be a horrible thing either. I know this is like watching paint dry. Ta da! How's that look? It's a hoo-woo. I love these little... Oh, what's that? <laughs> <laughs> My masterpiece. Where's that little eraser that I just had before? And how did I do that? So we got a woo. We got a woo. And now we almost have a who. Woohoo! course that's not going to come off. Well, I know what's going to go there. Something. If I can find them. We'll see how it looks. We'll put I need a teeny eensy one. 
C1. 1, 2. Hmm. Yeah, it's fine. I covered that up. Um, did I do everything to it? You guys. Hey, you guys. I'll give them blue eyes, too. Oh, yeah, I was going to show you. So. Just a little bit of blue. So. If you cut this twice on, you know, two different colors, you can put sunglasses on them. Or you could put them like that. Then there's, I had done it in this color. I mean, I could have done it more. Like he could have a scuba. Like that. But... I like it plainer. It's me, plain Jane. But they're really cute. Let me move this away. So we got that one, that one, and this one. They're fun. Hippos are fun. So I hope you like this. I hope it gave you some, some ideas. Woohoo! Get you a little excited about what's to come. Thanks, Sue. Love the glasses. I mean, I could put them on them. There's too much blue, though. Maybe maybe on that one. I could make sunglasses out of that. You just won't see his eyes. Oh, you could color some um, vellum. Ooh. Like cut out a pair of vellum, and then you'd have vellum to stick in there. And you could do it like green or something. Ooh, a brown. Then you could still kind of see his eyes underneath. I might try that after. Yeah, vellum. Ta-da. Yeah, there's some cute little accessories. And I think with some of the other things that are coming, there's a lot of, you know, mix and match. I mean, I'm, I'm finding a lot of uses with these um, decal rectangles. And then this set, stylish shapes between the circles. And now I'm using the squares. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. I'll be back on uh, Sunday. And you know my motto. I don't know what. But it'll be something. So, I'll see you all then. Thanks for joining me tonight. Good night, all.